Hey there crew, today I'm going to show you a couple different things. First I'm going to show you uh, how to draw Loudmouth, which is a character designed by graphic designer, muralist, and um, artist Greg Mike. So he works as like a street artist, a graphic designer, and uh, is currently based in Atlanta, Georgia, but has done murals, which are really large scale artworks, all across the country in major cities and he's bold and colorful and uses a lot of the elements and principles of design and I'm gonna show you how you can draw his character and then change it to fit what you like so first uh, we'll get his name on there, his name's Greg Mike and then his character is called Loudmouth so it's kind of a play on the word mouth because it's a loud mouth. So you're going to start by just making a big square. And then inside your bigger square, you're going to make a smaller square. It's going to look kind of like a picture frame. And then the smaller square is actually the loud mouth. So it's an open mouth. There are four teeth on the top row, four teeth on the bottom row, and then a big tongue in there too. One of the teeth, the third tooth uh, on the top row, also has like a chip out of it. That's kind of his signature. Um, so we'll do one, two. The third tooth has a chip in it. And then number four. So there's the top row of teeth. The bottom row of teeth are just four uh, little bunny hills. So one, two, three, four across. Then the tongue is kind of like the teeth it's just like two curved lines and then I'm gonna fill in the dark part of the mouth here and then his loudmouth characters they are whatever color that he wants he can also add uh, eyes and accessories and details you could even add arms or feet so that's just the base basic shape there's loudmouth then, I know that uh, you can also learn about color and contrast as well as pop culture and pop art through a craze called Among Us. So the character design for Among Us is pretty simple, but uh, you can use all sorts of different colors, accessories, and elements and principles of design with Among Us as well. So I'm going to show you how you could draw that. Uh, basic Among Us character and then how I've used it to incorporate some elements and principles of design uh, most importantly color and contrast so for starters if you want to do a little directed drawing here I'll show you how to draw the character it's a few lines a few curves a few shapes I'm gonna start with an oval like this an oval again is just a stretched out circle boom and then like an upside down U or a hill or a rainbow arc. We're going to go from the left and boom you stop at your original oval. Then I'm going to continue on the left hand side go all the way down over and up. There's one leg over with a curve. I'm going to make the other leg. It's almost like the base of a rectangle and up and stop at the little uh, headgear face shield there and then his little backpack shape boom it's kind of like a half an oval or a little hot dog there and then the Among Us characters I do like that there is some value uh, so there's kind of a highlight on the top here so I'm gonna just make a shape this part here would be in highlight then there's almost a curve down here this part is where the light hits our character so it would be lighter up in this area darker down here I might even use some shading marks some diagonal lines uh, just to show shading there some shading here maybe some shading under the shield and then there's good value like three values here so I'm gonna make almost some uh, circles there it's darkest here medium here and then bright white highlight here because the light is coming from over here so think of the Sun over here and it's hitting right here at the top for highlights touching the top here and then it gets darker so I'm going to show you an example so here's just 
uh, directed drawing maybe in your sketchbook you do a directed drawing to get the basic shapes of Loudmouth and the Among Us character and then from there you can decide what you want to do so if I'm looking at Greg Mike and again I have some cool uh, videos they're short little snippets of him uh, painting a basketball court and murals these big artworks with his graphic bold style so again in your sketchbook you can kind of practice those shapes and then here's some more practice I did in my sketchbook of Greg Mike characters so once I figure out what I want to include perhaps in a final copy I could get a bigger paper and start adding color but some ideas I had was a basketball player uh, so he's holding his basketball he's got his cool Nike headband he's holding up the number one because maybe it's uh, LeBron who just won the NBA Finals then he's got some cool sneakers and of course his chip tooth the loud mouth uh, mouth and then I even added eyes then I thought well I like dogs and cats maybe I'd have uh, an animal so again the mouth looks pretty funny I think it's even funnier on the cat I made the tongue sticking out so you can add other details uh, then I made a tennis player um, because I coach tennis and play tennis and then uh, I also wanted one just eating some good food so put a burger and some ice cream there so I came up with different ideas in my sketchbook planned and prepped and then maybe choose one to be a final copy um, or you could do them all as a final copy or just keep making more and more um, then for the Among Us character I love the basic shapes I was able to draw a lot pretty quickly but I really wanted to focus on color and contrast so if you remember contrast means opposite so you could really work with opposite complementary colors for a really bold artwork so this guy uh, I did the basic shapes just like I practiced in my sketchbook but then you can see I have it lighter at the top here and in these shapes uh, lighter medium dark so good value in that uh, face shield and then I filled it in red I wanted a red character and the opposite of red you guessed it in the background I have green verde green I even did a pattern I did like light green dark green and it looks like it's bursting from my character so it looks like there's light it looks like there's value it looks like there's contrast uh, with my colors and again if you don't remember complementary colors always look at your color wheel uh, or I'll remind you right here because uh, I included all the complementary colors I couldn't just choose one I liked my red and green but I wanted to do all the opposite contrasting colors from the color wheel so I have a little yellow amarillo and violeta purple verde green and rojo red just like in my larger one and then I also want to do azul blue and anaranjado orange and then you could also include an exclamation or an onomatopoeia so an exclamation could have an exclamation point a question could have a question mark and onomatopoeia uh, is a sound so like a boom or a crash or a bang uh, or a zoom perhaps zoom how appropriate for online learning but I wrote sus as uh, an among us reference so pop culture pop art uh, color contrast bold lines I thought the among us characters really related well with our Greg Mike characters and again you should uh, watch those videos to maybe be inspired by Greg Mike's murals and graphic art uh, but hopefully in your sketchbook you could plan some ideas and maybe make a couple final copies they don't have to be big they don't have to be major but it could be a stepping stone to a larger project so get some ideas in your sketchbook work like an artist think like an artist and then create like an artist so my champions uh, if you'd like to pick one Greg Mike or pick one among us or do both I would love to see what you come up with so keep up the good work adios amigos